Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to set and convert file formats on OBS. This is something that I've had to do personally while recording a lot of my own videos, and it's really simple. So to start off, if you want to set the file format for a new recording, you can just go to this file dropdown, click on settings, and go to the output tab, and then right here under recording format, you can select the uh, file type. So you have a few options here, and the default that OBS uses is FLV. Now OBS also offers a built-in remuxer, which is used to convert videos to MP4 with zero quality loss. So I just want to emphasize that there is absolutely no quality that's lost during this conversion, and it's really useful. So essentially it just takes your video data, puts it into a different container, and then that changes the file format. So to use that uh, converter, you just go to File, and then Remux Recordings, and I have a sample FLV file right here, and then we can just select that, and then Remux to MP4. And then if I go to Desktop here, you can see that this was the original, and then if you go to Properties, you can see that this is a MP4 file. And then this one, FLV. So a lot of people don't like to record to MP4 directly because if certain problems happen during the recording, like OBS crashing or your laptop running out of battery, for example, the entire MP4 file gets corrupted and it's completely unusable. Now other file formats like FLV or MKV can still be saved and recovered if a crash happens, which is really useful. So those file formats are basically invincible. However, the catch is that most video editors don't accept FLV or MKV files directly. So the ultimate solution here is to record in FLV or MKV, convert that finished recording to MP4, and then drop that MP4 file right into your video editor. And of course, if you're confident that the recording is not going to get corrupted, you can just record straight to MP4. So that's about it for this video. Just thought I'd make a quick one explaining file formats because it can sometimes get kind of confusing. So thanks for watching. Hope I could help and I'll see you in a future video.